So you're looking to buy yourself a cute little pet, maybe a brand new ship set or emote bundle, but you don't have enough ancient coins, what do you do? Spend money on the game and take the easy way out? No. You find ancient skeletons, that's super easy. Thanks for watching. In all seriousness though, there are a couple things you can do to increase your chances of finding ancient skeletons regularly, so you can buy yourself that awesome Ruby Splash Tail skin. So without further ado, strap in and let's get into it. Before we get into the video, I'm currently live over on Twitch, so if you like the video, make sure to not only like and subscribe, but also come into the stream and say hi. And if you want to talk to me and other members of the Discord community, join the Mystic Penthouse link in the description. Today I'm going to show you how to increase your chances of finding ancient skeletons scattered around the Sea of Thieves, and I will show you how this all works out later on in the video. Before we get into the tips and tricks, make sure you know what ancient skeletons look and sound like when they spawn. I would hate for one to spawn on you and you not realise it and miss it. I'll play a clip now so you can see exactly what it is to look out for. Please keep in mind that you will only have 20 seconds from when these spawn to kill them otherwise they will despawn and you would have missed your chance. First of all what you're going to want to do is visit islands as often as possible and I don't mean just canning yourself off for 10 seconds at a time at every island you sail past, I mean spend time at as many islands as possible during the time you play, whether this be for stocking up your boat, fishing or just doing voyages. More time spent on islands increases your chances massively. You're also going to be wanting to explore the islands you visit, especially the larger islands. Moving around on these islands covers up more ground searching for these skeletons, but from what I've seen and been able to gather, ancient skeletons often spawn around the shores of the islands, however this does not write off the possibility that they will spawn in more denser areas. Keep in mind the longer you're on an island the more chance a skeleton will have of spawning there. But be weary, do not spend too long on one island as there are many more around the map which the ancient skeletons could be lurking. Overall it is proven that being active on islands as well as spending a decent amount of time on them spawns the skeletons that you're looking for. I would personally recommend that if you are Pirate Legends that you put yourself down a regular voyage as this will have you travelling around different islands on the map. It gives you something to do which is productive on the game while searching for the ancient skeletons. This also applies for other voyages, again another suggestion here, for non-legends, pick yourself up a Gold Hoarders Vault Voyage as the compass will take you around the area of the map you're in to different islands. On these islands, don't just complete the voyage and move on, again spend some time getting supplies and lurking around. If you're completely stuck and don't feel like doing any voyages, do a bit of fishing on different islands for those hunters call accommodations. If you want to know what bait to use or what island to catch the fish you're looking for, I'll leave a link in the description where you can find all of that information. Fishing will kill a lot of time and you can move from place to place, Fishing in different spots around the islands, again increasing those chances of finding ancient skeletons. I would recommend to only spend 25 to 30 minutes on each island as there is probably a threshold here to the point where you will not see any skeletons on the island past a certain point. There does seem to be a current theory whereby if only one member of your crew is on an island at one time there is more of a likelihood of them spawning. However, this is yet to be confirmed and me personally cannot see Rare putting this as a feature in the game, so you will just have to see for yourselves on that one. These skeletons will only take around 4 sword hits to kill, so make sure you act quick if one spawns and I wish you all the absolute best of luck. With all of that you should be well on your way to purchasing your favourite item from the Pirate Emporium. If you like this video make sure to subscribe, leave a like, check out the other videos on my channel and I'll see you guys in the next one.